okay now let's do the elevator and then after that the rudder now to do that let's move the plastic cover remove the pins and move the plastic cover up and again insert the pins let's begin with the uh, elevator first now in the elevator the first part is from sheet 2 now sheet 2 is here this is the center pillar is the first sheet 2 the center pillar is here this one gently crack the attachment and keep it here now use pins insert the pins through the part one at the bottom and one at the top one somewhere in the middle like this two pins so that it does not move now the second is the bottom uh, of the elevator that is the trailing edge of the elevator that is the second that again is from sheet 2 the, that part is here again just crack the attachment the attachment is very thin so just with a little pressure you can crack it now keep it like this there is a notch uh, here and the groove keep it and apply glue and after applying glue just hold both the sides like this for about 2 to 5 seconds yes now it is dry now the third is the edges both the edges both the edges again from sheet 2 the edges are here yes two edges are there again just crack the attachment and the part will fall out yes these are the two edges here it is, two edges are here so you can keep the part on the drawing like if you are confused just keep the part on the drawing it is not of the same size keep it aside so here this is the two edges keep it on the drawing and you see like a jigsaw puzzle just see if it is fitting now this is fitting apply glue just one drop wait for five seconds two to five seconds yeah it is done. Let's do this side. Yes, and that is done. Now, the fourth is the middle sparse here, that is there again from sheet 2. Yeah, two are there, one for each side. Again, just gently crack it. Yes. Here one, and there is the second one. Take it out gently. Now the two are there one on each side there is this exact groove which takes the part fit it in there just like jigsaw puzzle and then apply glue same repeated on the other side Now the fourth was that and then we will have to do this the top two that again is here from sheet two so this is one and same part again one more it is here from sheet two like this.
hold it in place apply one drop of glue wait for it to dry and then apply the other side yes now the side yes okay now all the parts are done the size parts are done the size already cut and now there are these two red parts red parts are not cut to size which means we have to cut them to size now these parts have to be cut from extra sparse in sheet 3 now this is sheet 3 we have this extra that is given there extra written there take the sparse from there and then cut them to size these are extra sparse take one to cut them to size just keep it dry fit do a dry fit like this and just mark the place where you need to cut just by just gently pressing that line will be visible and then just press the blade a little and then that's it and another one for the top again take the measurement and now fix it fix both as a dry fit first yes and apply glue repeat the same step for the other side and then apply glue yes now the elevator is done so gently remove the pins hold the part hold the pin on either side and then pull the pin if you don't hold the pin on either side the pin will break the part because the glue would have attached the pin to the part wooden part now to remove that use the scale same way like before you see it is done so keep this aside now we need to do the rudder to do the rudder you have the parts again from sheet 2 ok take all the parts of the rudder there are 5 parts which are already cut to size One, two, three, four, five. Five parts are there already which are cut to size. Now take any one part, like let's say the top here. This is the top of the rudder or the tail fin. And then again use pins inserted through the part. Two pins. And then with this being fixed tightly to the work table use that to fix the other parts ok with that already fixed we will use we will fix this part now yes wait for 2 seconds 2 to 5 seconds now that is fixed totally dry and let's do the bottom this way yes. use the plan to know the orientation just like jigsaw puzzle yeah, apply glue and now 
that is also fixed now let's do the middle here yes now that again is done middle is done now the front of the rudder apply glue at the top and the bottom two places where it is getting yeah now again we have a red part here which we need to cut to size from the extra spars this is again one more extra spar do a dry fit here now when there is an angle there what you do is cut that angle on the part also on the extra spar also like this see this earlier it was square now it is at an angle that angle will match here yeah. and now take the measurement Again, one more here. Gently press the knife on the extra spar and it will make a small cut. That is enough to crack open the crack the spar. Now it is already in place, apply glue. Yes, so with that, the rudder is also done.